Kobetsi noted that the heat wave will continue over the northern parts of the country with extremely high temperatures. Temperatures are also expected to rise in the southern parts of Namibia to as high as 38 degrees Celsius. However, cloud cover and rain can be expected, but he says they won't have much significance in relief from the heat. The way we are seeing it that is because of the of the current uh, high pressure system that are still dominant. We can see the Botswana is still dominant. It's pu still pushing this uh, trapped air which is causing subsidence uh, over the region and temperatures uh, for this time we are seeing that with the dominant feature which is the high pressure system we are seeing this uh, uh, heat condition still to continue in the next couple of days uh, up towards the uh, end of the month. Khobetsi is urging members of the public to take the necessary precautions against the current high temperatures, saying they have potential to seriously impact health. It is very high temperatures and there is also high humidity. Then it also can cause a lot of dehydration uh, for, for, for people, especially for those who are exposed uh, to be outside there in the field. And uh, they will therefore also encourage them at least to take a lot of fluids like uh, water. And because also with this heat, it can also cause some health effects, for example, cramps. And if you are out there for, for, for a period of time, it can also uh, result in stroke. So we also advise people not to be exposing themselves uh, for a longer period outside. He also cautioned people to be extra careful when handling fire in fields, as heat waves have been proven to contribute immensely to field fires. Hobetsi says this year's rainy season looks promising compared to previous years. We are seeing now that we're within a, a two days' time from now onwards and towards towards end of the month, we're seeing a lot of moisture drifting in from DRC through the Congo Air Basin. And this type of moisture will then uh, trigger uh, also already now. Because of the heat that's already there, it will trigger then thunderstorms and showers. So we are hopeful that... Uh, towards the end of, of, of this month that they will have some rains extending from the north central areas uh, towards the southern parts of Namibia. The outlook uh, that, that was issued, uh, the outlook that was issued by SADEC is that um, uh, for the region uh, in, in, in general uh, we are expecting a, a normal a normal rainfalls uh, over for the first period of time because our rainy season is in October, November, December and then for the second period which is January, February, March is that the onset will improve. That's what the, the models are picking up. Chulain Afuka, NBC News, Bantuk.